Hi, my name is Cole Davison, professional healer. Uh, this is Apollo Oak. I call him Apollo. He's eight years old. So this year we qualified for my first NFR. Um, been rodeoing full time for the last five years, four or five years. Um, been through a lot, I guess, ups and downs. Um, been close and didn't make it. And this year we finally got it done. Just worked real hard and finally got a horse that really fits me and and uh, makes it a lot easier. And had a good header this year that helped me out a lot. And we, uh, Apollo goes a lot. He goes to Canada and all down here and we do, we go to a lot of rodeos and he's, I've only got one other horse so he pretty much gets, gets the brunt of it all and, and uh, he takes it pretty well. And they keep him sound here at Brazos Valley and it, it makes for, for my job and his job a lot easier not to have to worry about it. Uh, I guess our first big win would have been St. Paul, um, which is an awesome rodeo, one of my favorite rodeos, uh, with the trees in the arena. And we drew good and made good runs and ended up winning it, and, and that was pretty cool. And then we, we, uh, we won Great Falls, Montana. Um, just kind of plugged along all summer and, and placed a lot. And placed a lot in two headers. And I guess we won some at some one headers, but mainly just those two two headers we won first and then we uh, we won Armstrong Canada at the end of the year. That kinda was a boost for us towards the end of the year when it's hard to win in the northwest and then did some good down here. We placed good at Stephenville and that was cool to kinda the last rodeo of the season place in front of everybody that's we're home in front of and that was cool. My mom and dad both have been around horses their whole lives, so technically we didn't have much choice but to be around horses. And I started roping uh, when I was little, just I don't know the exact age, but I started branding calves and doing that. And then we moved to Oklahoma, and my dad was training horses, and I lucked out to be around a guy that that taught me a lot about roping at a young age, named Mickey Nelson, and and we. I'd go over there every day my dad would take me. I'd ask him all the time, but uh, my dad, we didn't have a lot of money, but he uh, he bought me a couple steers to track around out in the pasture, and I would just go after him every day, keep, keep following them around until I could catch them. And so that was my daily routine at the house. So. My wife, Whitney, runs barrels, and so she, she went some this summer. She's got younger horses, but... She went some to try to season them, and so it's really fun to get to take the girls everywhere. And I've got a little girl, Letty, that's about to be a year old, and then we've got a girl, uh, Millie, that's eight years old. And so it's cool to take them and see different things, and we all go go do different things. We're not just stuck at the rodeo, which, which makes it a lot more fun and, and uh, actually worth doing. If I couldn't do that, I wouldn't do it.